One time I, I sold pictures of my feet because I was like, I you need sold? To, yeah, yeah. Me and my friend Greg. So I had to like lay down on the floor. He took Wait, no, pictures I'm of my dying. feet. He did like yeah. soles of the feet? Yeah. Or like toesies? I think, no, it was like the soles <laughs> like this, like straight on. Like looking at the bottom <laughs> Wait, of my feet. Wait, but how much did you get paid for this? I think it was like. Chemical X. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Chemical X Podcast. It's your girl, Veronica. And your other girl, Alessia. And today, we have a very special guest, um, Joe. Hey. <laughs> very special guest. <laughs> um, I just want to point out before we started recording, five shots, four shots, three shots. First uh, those of all, are all, those are skewed. So but an equality here. Alessia's an alcoholic. That's what <laughs> guys. We, what he's first trying of to all, say is I had alcoholic. three shots. If you really get down to it, because I put Red Bull in mine, so like we're all at the same pace. <laughs> I don't. She poured the same amount and then topped hers up with Red Bull. That's not the same thing. It's just you're drunk with a. Those heart are attack. just shots. Those were shots. Yeah, I mean, okay, fine. but there was Red Bull inside. It's also four p.m. Just to give everyone context about this episode, <laughs> so we don't know where it's going. Also, I'm not an alcoholic, but now everyone thinks I am. So hello. It's okay. You're on vacation. <laughs> So, that's mean. true it's just vacation 4 p.m that's totally fine vacation in brooklyn <laughs> <laughs> i don't think we're actually in brooklyn by the way joe came in and he was like you guys are I, in the ocean dude like, the, like, i don't, know, I don't where, know where you guys are but yeah. it's not brooklyn <laughs> it's very far we're basically in new jersey <laughs> like honestly so guys we're not on a new york trip we're actually in new jersey we're actually we're jersey girls at the end of the day you know ratchet as they would say oh okay <laughs> like, like, we're already hating on people <laughs> Two minutes in and we're already eating up people. <laughs> it's fine. Um, but uh, yeah, we are on a little, you know, vacation. But mm -hmm. for me, like if you could drive there, it's not really a vacation. But we're coming from Canada, which have you been? Yeah, a couple times. I was just there not too long ago. Okay, you didn't hit me up. When you yeah, I know. Oh, that's sick. That's <laughs> Wait, sick. have you ever been to Montreal? No. Okay, so you've never been. Yeah. <laughs> Montreal is like the fun, like it's like the French fun. Hold as on. fuck, right? Okay, not really, though. You guys are from Montreal? Yeah. What, okay. Say that again? Montreal. Okay. What well, I said Montreal. it like slowly, yeah, I know. <laughs> Do you guys speak French or no? Mm hmm Okay. Yeah. yeah. But we're like nice. bilingual, like it's like cool. Mm. Are you, you Italian? Yeah. 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 I can tell. Um, <laughs> Wait. Uh, you know what, guys? Hold on a second. Camera. What do you mean you can tell? Uh, you said bilingual. Bilingual. Yeah. Okay. Um... No, but I mean, I'm very jealous because I wish I could be bilingual, uh, but I've never been to uh, Montreal ever in my life, but I do want to go. But the only thing I've ever heard about it is strip clubs and that everyone's like, which no, is I'm dying. Not, I'm by dying. the way, I want you to know that it's so weird that we get that rep because we actually have a law that we cannot make a new strip club. And the only strip clubs that can exist are the ones that like have been yeah. there. It's like, is a that because there's rule? too fucking many? <laughs> no, we have like three good ones. I mean, we have three. <laughs> <laughs> Veronica, Veronica, bad Veronica hold that. on. Three of them that we go to, the rest, it's no. like nobody talks about, but there, trust me, there's a lot more. How often do you go to this strip club? Wait, not you're often. also a stripper? <laughs> trust me, there's a lot more. <laughs> no, that was okay. very like, don't Veronica. talk about my industry like that. She's like, I've worked <laughs> in bad places before. <laughs> She's like, don't talk to me about strip yeah. clubs. You guys are just going to give me a bad name. The whole How often do you go to a strip club? Though? Uh, maybe like three times a year. That's kind okay. of a lot. I can't remember the last time. Relax. I can't remember the last time I've been to a strip club. Three times a year is a lot. Wow. I was asking because I didn't know if it was like something that people like do, it's you know, like once every two months or something. Well, then in that case, I'm I mean, Gucci. Yeah, but we I have know. like one really good one where people will go to like party and it's like, yeah. oh, but you know what? I will say what Montreal is known for is uh, we do um, happy ending massages. I did hear Wait, that as well. Wait, do you know about that because of your ex-boyfriend or? <laughs> <laughs> no, I just know that that's why people come to. What was that? Um, my ex-boyfriend. Uh, <laughs> you want to hear about it? Sorry. <laughs> Let's dive he right in. He didn't work there. No. no, he went there for okay. massages. Don't he get frequented. it twisted. And you but, were like cool with that. No, I wasn't cool with that. Got so, it. Basi so basically, <laughs> so basically she didn't know yeah. about it. Well, what happened was um I I I would catch him going on like a Montreal like massage parlor site and I was like, "Why are you going on this site? Like are you getting happy ending massages?" And he was like, "No, no, it's cuz like when I jerk off at work, the Wi-Fi isn't strong enough in the bathroom, so I have to like preload the page and I like the pictures of the girls." And I was like, "I don't listen." I don't <laughs> so wait, wait, wait. Like... How long did you date him after that? 
Tiger. I love how we have a podcast talking about red flags. Meanwhile, she was like, so I heard that and I was like, okay, everything's good. So we're in New York right now, as you guys know. And sometimes, you know, when you're traveling with your expensive goods, especially when you have the luck like I do with losing my luggage, shit going wrong. I just have the worst luck on trips. It's nice to have jewelry that like I can have a lot of, but I'm not so worried if it gets stolen because it's affordable and I could just buy it again, but it still looks amazing. Are you saying New York's not safe? I'm saying anywhere with me is not safe. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> um, but guys, every jewels has the nicest jewelry and it looks amazing. No one would ever be able to tell the difference. It also doesn't even tarnish. So if you're traveling this summer or going anywhere really and you have bad luck like me, or just going anywhere. It's always nice to have your backups that you know you're not really caring if you lose them. I'm actually wearing the silver tennis bracelet and their silver hoops, and I'm obsessed. They're lightweight, so they don't bother my ears. If you guys are looking for any affordable jewelry, head on to Every Jewels and use our discount code ChemicalX at checkout to receive 20% off your entire order. So it's a win-win. You get to travel with a million pieces of jewelry and you get a discount. Honestly, Ella, that tennis bracelet is looking a little too sparkly and you might be the reason we get robbed. I was like, I yeah, love so how like you so but you were like, oh, okay. I was like, checks out. Yeah, but like <laughs> the part that I'm thinking about is like you're jerking off at work. Yeah. Right? I don't want to ask what he does because I don't want to get into his personal business and I'm not judging him. But I am just saying, like, <laughs> but he's not there's jerk. not many jobs that you could be like, I'm going to go jerk off in the back real quick. Like, that's crazy. Like, how intense is your job? <laughs> I think if... I don't People remember. Urges, you know? I don't remember. This was a, a really long time ago. This is not my I, last I don't think it's, boyfriend. like, not remembering. I think it's just, like, blacking out. You know what I mean? I actually can't remember what he did at the time, though. But... um if you if look if that's there's a will there's a way you can jerk i think I'm we sure, should call him <laughs> i'm sure that you can jerk off anywhere you want to jerk off i know people the that jerk off in their car <laughs> wait, 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 wait 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 i've heard people okay. and i won't name names now we're going off script I, I won't name names but i've heard people jerking off in their car i've heard of that too okay, but you're like by experience have you no, ever no, jerked no, off I've in never, your car no, i've never like i don't think i've ever jerked off in like a weird place like ever i have What's considered a weird place? <laughs> like not your fucking bed or like your apartment. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. Like yeah. yeah. That's usually where that happens. Uh that. but uh I've also never done that when I was like away with like my friends or something, like in an Airbnb. I'm like, I gotta Really? I gotta get this off. No, I'm always just like, I gotta get through this trip and then I'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> like we'll be all right and we'll get home and it'll be fine. Uh, well, we have a friend that will take bathroom jerk off breaks. What? Yeah. Okay. Well, he's just like announcing. Not only, not like, only. Just does, like, just like, okay, wait. Go not off. only does he take bathroom breaks, he'll be like, "Alessia, like you're showering now," and I'll be like, "Yeah," and he'd be like, "How long approximately are you gonna be?" And I was like, "Okay, maybe like 35 minutes." He goes, "Okay, cool," and like I know he's jerking off. It's like our gay best showering. friend. Oh. Yeah. Damn, that's fucking crazy, dude. That, you guys I mean, are look. close. <laughs> He's like, uh, Montreal, okay. I was He's like, like uh, let's cross that, that off the list. Yeah, but, always, like, I've never like told someone that I was about to like, no, or I would guess like leave just, clues. Like breadcrumbs, like no, I just like, I put two and two together. I think it's more so like don't just walk out of the bathroom when you're done your shower. Like maybe knock before coming <laughs> no, back into the he room. Told <laughs> <laughs> maybe give me like a one two, like coming in. Oh my god! my shower. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> That's but crazy. you normally hear when the water stops, but like yeah. One of my friends told me when he was in high school, he saw a girl. Uh, he was like walking in the hallway. And some girl, like, her shirt came up, and he saw her thong, and he's like, and I had to go home and jerk off. I'm like, that is the craziest shit wait, I've heard in my life, dude. Okay, wait. Like, he saw her thong and was like, well, that's it. He's my like, day's over. Wait. I'm taking the he take He's the like, I'm not even making it. Home, he's like, I'm not even. Bus. He's like, I'm not making it home. I'm doing it in the car, which we were just like. Yeah, yeah I'm not no. going to lie. If it was my ex, he'd be jerking off in the bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> he'd be like, immediately. Let's yeah. go. On the deli's Wi-Fi next door. He'd be like, well, like school. You can't Wait, go the I need to know, like, what did you, what did you answer when he was like, "I just jerk off in the bathroom"? <laughs> he was just like, "Yeah." Were you like, oh, "Okay, like, understandable"? Um, and you said you, you caught him like always going on this thing. No, right? I think I caught him like twice, and I was like, "Not even once." I thought I was like, <laughs> no. "Why though?" Wait, this is. But then Who's I was like, here? if you're going for the picture, I'm like, first of all, porn sites have pictures. Like, why'd you have to go on massage parlor? He had an excuse for everything, though. 
manipulator is toxic, you know? That's why we're here to this day. I have trauma. That's why I have a podcast. The guy is a talker, clearly. Yeah. Because he got out, it weaseled his way out of that one. Well, I can be convinced easily, as you can see. Oh, well, uh, you? Absolutely. You can tell me, like, you can <laughs> no, tell no, me, no, like, no. Fuck. No. You she's can, like, oh, you're an idiot. Yeah, no. <laughs> she's like, you're fu-. She's like, she tells me she's not an alcoholic all the time, and I believe it. Yeah, so. I know. You've got everyone fooled. <laughs> see right through that shit. Yeah. No, but I, I remember that was like sort of like a culture shock too. When I, culture shock, that was kind of <laughs> dramatic. But like when I went to Canada and everything is written in like English and then French, I'm like, damn. Yeah. Like, Wait, they in are Toronto? French, yeah. Like Toronto I went to like is the, like fully English though. I know, but when I went to the store, it was like like an orange juice would be written like oh, orange yeah. juice, and then it would say like whatever the fuck it is in French. Right. Interesting. Yeah. Well, in Montreal everything like all the signs have to be in french first so french has to be bigger Mm -hmm. and like titles and stuff so like for the longest time we couldn't have victoria's secret stores because it wasn't french so Uh, like we can only have stores that can be like either translated or i love how any store she could have picked she chose victoria's Victoria's secret (laughs) (laughs) it's like like, so you so you do work in a massage parlor (laughs) (laughs) it all makes sense though yeah he's like Checks out. I got it now. He was looking at massage of you. parlors and strip clubs. That's okay, so you've never been to Montreal. And also, you guys can drink or be in bars like very early, right? Eighteen. Eighteen. Yeah. Yeah. I thought it was like sixteen for some reason. I feel like he's like, yeah. Judging so, by the way this went down, probably they should bump okay, it up listen, to twenty. Not- <laughs> He's like, I thought it was. It breeds irresponsibility for sure. Be- I think it's better though because by the time you're twenty-one, you're like clubbing, like. It's not even. No, I agree. You know what it is? It's like we started earlier than 18. So by 21, it's like, okay, relax, everyone. Yeah. Yeah. You know? I think that like in in New York, I feel like everyone starts early. Like you drink in like the park, like a homeless person. (laughs) Did you have a fake ID? Hell yeah. (laughs) I had a fake ID, but it wasn't like one that I paid money for. And like it was my picture or anything. It was like one of my friends is three years older than me. So when I was 18, I used his and then I remember I tried to use my brother's. He's eight years older than me. But we, like, looked similar at that time. It only I only had to use it once, and it worked, and I was like, whatever. I always hated everyone who had, like, an older sibling or, like, a... It's such an easy like, thing. It's so easy. Like, for me, I'm like, I have two brothers. I'm like, how does this work? Okay, but I love that he's never been to Montreal, though. Yeah, yeah. I need to go. Well, so actually you actually never had ketchup chips. No, I have. You've had ketchup chips? Why do you think they only exist in this fucking one city in the world? Wait, they do. They I don't. Love that. They, they only sell them in bags. Them. Like Lay's, I think, like makes them, don't they? I mean, yeah, Lay's makes them. Yeah, yeah, like Lay's makes them. But you, you don't have ketchup chips in the U.S. No, I, yeah. But yeah. I have some, yeah, but I think they have them in Trump. We were going to make you try ketchup chips. I hate to. Ruin your surprise, but should I we have... try again and just like act like you have <laughs> but, it? But you know what's the <laughs> what worst? What is part? that? We had even another bag of chips that we were like, let's make you try them. And for they're... sure, he has not tried. For those. sure, you have not tried. For these, sure, by the way. Veronica. But we ate them on the way here. <laughs> <laughs> what chips? <laughs> they're called hickory sticks. I don't know what the fuck that yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> hickory sticks? Oh wait, is that the like the thin? They're like, like little thin sticks. And like it, yeah, I think I I don't know. No, those don't, don't do trash. it. I mean, how I think they, I know what you're talking about, but those are ass. They're disgusting. So yeah, why did you eat like the them. whole bag? I kind of like them on the way here. No offense. Gross. I didn't like them. Mm. I ate them because it was... Have you tried Smarties, sight. though? That's our only other... Smarties. This. Oh, my God. He hasn't oh, yeah, tried... Too. He hasn't tried Smarties. And they're also French and English, so you could be culture shocked. <laughs> <laughs> How do you pronounce that? Gagné. Gagné. It means win. Do you know any well, French? We. We? Oui. <laughs> That's it. Every time I talk to any guy who does not speak French, they'll be like, Voulez-vous coucher avec moi? I don't even know. That's what does like that mean? That's like the number one thing. Means? No, I have no idea. Voulez-vous coucher avec moi? You don't know what it's that It's like means? in no. a song. It's like everybody no, knows I know. it. It means, I know the song too, It means you want to sleep with me. Does it really? Yeah. What the fuck? That's what the song is saying? Yeah. Voulez-vous coucher avec moi? Is it like an M&M? Kind of. I but mean, like more candy You know, we have Smarties, but they're not this. What do you, you mean? You have Smarties? Yeah. What is but it? But it's not this. Wait, it's like, what? Yeah, it's a completely different thing. Um, You're like, I kind of like this. <laughs> yeah, like, <laughs> what? this whole motherfucking <laughs> box. <laughs> um, no. Hold on, let me get my phone out. Wait, thoughts? He's like, let me eat a couple more and see. <laughs> Hold on. Hmm. I don't know how to feel about Smarties. Like, if I'm going These trick or treating though. and I'm a kid, like, that's the last thing I'm eating. Yeah. No, what, what do you I, mean? This is, wait, hold on. I leave the Smarties in the bottom of the, the right? Halloween bag. Coffee crisp. All the way. Ew. What the fuck is that? Coffee, Chris. Wait. You're a child and you're eating something coffee flavored? Yeah, it's disgusting. Oh my God. Be a child. Don't grow up. Coffee, Chris, is ass. <laughs> coffee, dude. 
I'm not even a huge coffee girl, and I love coffee crisp. It's Mars Bar at number one. Okay, we're not doing this. It's Mars Bar first. Oh, Henry first. Ew. <laughs> you have the worst taste in candies. You guys don't have like fucking Kit Kats <laughs> I was going to say yeah, like Kit Did you know so that? So where is that in this conversation? Kit Kat or Twix? Okay, Kit Kat's No, but good. have you had a Twix Mars is, Bar? Twix is up there for me. No, it's number one. Okay, but Mars Bar is not what? Mars Bar is Oh, but those are rockets. Wait, let me see. <laughs> I mean, I'm reading the package. The bag says, but that's rockets. If you wanted to, by the way, give us a compliment, you can just. You <laughs> what know are you what talking mean? about? <laughs> These are Wait. rockets. What? Smarties as rockets? Yeah, and those are good. This shit's a good. They're like Here, chalk. You. They're like chalk, kind of. Okay, well, it's not. Yeah, wait. I've had those, but yeah, they're they, called rockets oh. for us. Oh. Look. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Guys, how are they doing that? I've had cooler. those. They're just called rockets Yo, how for is us. Nobody's not suing each other. It's like, it's the same fucking candy. With a wait, I'm name. so confused. <laughs> but rockets is just way cooler. I would say. I would say I mean, it is. I would prefer to be called a rocket over a Smartie. Yeah. These are just like well, flat You know no one's calling you a Smartie. Okay, bye guys. Uh, bye guys. <laughs> thanks for having me. <laughs> okay. Um, so I wanted to say, and then this was one. Of, you're just fucking all my shit up. But I was gonna say ruined your podcast. Yeah, ruined it. Just go. Yeah. But I was gonna say, have you ever been on another girl's podcast? But now you're saying that you have. Yeah. Wait. But I, wait. I kind of thought that you you haven't been on another, on another girl's, girl's podcast. Yeah. Like I feel like I always see you on guys' podcasts. Veronica's like, I yeah. stalked you so much. What do you mean you've yeah. been on another like, girl's I'm your podcast? Man. What to do be you fair, mean? I don't know that the other episode came out either yet or ever i don't know <laughs> what'd you say no. on there that she was like no 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 i just one. like i don't it wasn't that long ago and i don't know if she's like gearing up to mm. release a bunch of shit okay i don't know yeah but yeah i think i don't do you know. think he signed the same thing he signed before he got on our podcast <laughs> <laughs> i've never signed a release form <laughs> in my life i no, don't I'm think crying. that's it's, not true i'll tell you why one time i was an extra on mtv show that never aired and that's when I signed my other release form. You really are involved in a lot of projects that don't air. It's, yeah. yeah. Are you, yeah. Is this one going to air? I like, don't well, know if you're successful It's because, I'll not. tell you why we did that, because we had someone on, and then he was like, delete the episode, and we were like, listen. Why? What happened? He was just like, I got a new job, and like, I'm getting like, no, he was like, I'm getting this a promotion, is what happened. and like, it looks he bad. He said a lot of shit that wasn't true, and then he was getting backlash for it. Yeah, I think. Don't come on and. And lie. And lie. Just be what truthful. What kind of shit? And then you're good. I like mean, crazy shit? I don't want to have to delete this episode. Oh, so maybe that's not it. No, no, no. But yeah, no, I, th- I thought, um, for some reason, I thought you hadn't been on another girl's podcast, but I guess like you haven't been on one that aired. So this might, this might be. <laughs> this the- is, uh, yeah, I think this is my first one. Well, guys, I don't, I don't know with the interruption there. <laughs> maybe not. Yeah. He's like, and this is my last. If she keeps drinking, we probably can't post this. So that's <laughs> it. I hate you guys. Okay, but I had yeah. a question. Okay. Um, as you know, one does on a podcast. Take mm-hmm. your sip. Go. I'll let, I'll let you think about it. Um, what would you? What would be the first thing you would do if you were a girl for the day? <laughs> what would I do? First, no, but first thing you wake up, mm. you're like, and you're also wait. I gotta check you're everything a hot out. Girl, but oh, you're I'm a hot, hot girl. Okay. You're a hot girl. Okay. He's a rocket. Yeah, yeah. You're a rocket. I'm a rocket. Yeah. I would probably wake up, check out what I got going on. I'd be like, all right. Oh, and I want to orgasm as a girl because I heard it's way better. Because I heard that. Their orgasms are longer. <laughs> there, like it's not, not, not a, like, <laughs> girls. He we're all a bunch of guys. Been, yeah. <laughs> I told you he's never been talking to girls before. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's not what I mean. I'm crying. But I did hear that women have like longer orgasms, or they have more like nerve endings or something. I don't know. But yeah, I think we have like triple the amount of nerve endings. Yeah, that's in the clit than on the tip of the dick. I heard Don't ask that. me why I'm so educated in the tip of the dick. <laughs> the tip of the dick. I also heard that. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to say this because it feels true in this moment, but I don't know if this is actually the animal. But I heard that pigs have like an orgasm that's like a minute 30. Okay, like wait. long as fuck. I think that's he's calling long. us pigs. I don't know. <laughs> that's not what I'm saying. No, wait. wait. That's I gotta a bit look it long. Up. No, nah, yeah, that's like crazy. But kind of like. Also, you ever see the video of the dude that can't stop having orgasms? It's so fucked up, and he like can't <laughs> Wait, live I've a normal life. Wait, I've never seen that, bro. The, I, I feel bad <laughs> making fun of him because it's it's actually torture. Yeah. Too much of a good thing is a bad thing. Too much of a good. Would you rather never orgasm again or orgasm? I was just about to ask. Or that. never stop orgasm. I was just about to ask. I would never. That. I would be like never again. Never how are you? Again. How can you function? But it hurts after a while. You're gonna be. Hurt. Hell yeah! It hurts. After I come, it's like. 
Why are you trying to make me come again? Leave me alone. Yeah. For Get like, away. I, I need, yeah. Like, it's like an echo. I'm like a, I'm like, give me some time. It's like an electrocution. It's like, whoa. <laughs> Sorry. It's not a minute and 30, or whatever I said, a minute or don't whatever. Don't add a one and say 11 and 30. Oh, no. It's 30 minutes. Okay. What? I don't buy that. Can you a imagine pig? working on a farm? Also, who got, <laughs> who got this statistic? Google, who got this? <laughs> like no, I want to know. Who, who, who found that Wikipedia? Out. Like, oh, no, oh. but I want to know who found that. Nah, like, I mean, which he, guy he, was like, you're still they coming? They breed pigs, I'm sure. And then it's like, yo, this thing's still coming after that. Like, but it mustn't be coming. It's just like orgasming. No? You can't come for 30 minutes. Oh, and like, I you mean, can you orgasm. To, I'm, I'm like, wait, hold as one thing. And you can orgasm for 30 minutes? Yeah, because there's no fluid. Eventually, you run out of cum. <laughs> for 30 minutes? How big? To me, it, like, I just orgasms make... are cum. To me. Yeah, no, I know, that's but I'm I saying, feel. like, I'm talking about ejaculation. Yeah, he's not like, okay. <laughs> oh, my God. 30 minutes of ejaculation. <laughs> the fucking pig sorry, would be a pound. Like, uh, let me meet I'm your just... boyfriend, please. <laughs> Saying. Yeah, I don't know what's going on over there. Yeah, I don't know. The massage parlor. I thought we were on the same like, page, but I don't know. Like, what the hell's going turns on? Turns out uh, I'd rather be She's with like, a drunk girl. <laughs> Wait, 30 minutes? Yeah, that's crazy. How long do men come for? Like three seconds. I don't know. Have like. you ever no, hooked up with a guy? <laughs> no, but, but I, I want to know. But you know Sorry. what I feel like? What is that I feel like? like guys exaggerate how long they're coming for. Why the fuck Wait, would you do that? Wait, how can they Because I they feel have like... Actual... No, 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 no. Yes, but I'm saying like I feel like... I just feel like it's shorter than it. Like the feeling, because I feel like for girls, like you're in it. You're like, you're like, don't talk to me for like, how long do you think a girl orgasm lasts? Like at well, least 30 I'll seconds. I'll tell you for me, it's not 30 seconds. It's Listen. like less. Like 12 seconds? I would say like, yeah, 12 10, seconds? 10, 12. This is on average men experience about 22 seconds. Well, it's oh, like, okay, so then woman has to be more. It it's like to. you're you're like legs tingle and you're like heating up, oh, you but like out. the actual time you're coming yeah, is once probably it's like, like mm, it's probably like eight, to the races it's probably here. like eight or seven seconds. God I don't damn, know. this says about forty percent of 120 women estimated the duration of their orgasms to be thirty to sixty seconds or even longer. Yeah. No. Is that including That's, like the the legs oh, heating up? Yeah. I love that shit. <laughs> like gearing up. But I think that's included. <laughs> In the in the orgasm, I, I wouldn't include that. Like the, I, the me like, too. I wouldn't include that. I would say it's about like seven eight seconds. Oh damn! I think that's fair. My, yeah, yeah. Eight and thirty to sixty are like completely different numbers. First of all, coming for thirty seconds is longer than having sex. <laughs> Th sorry, I mean thirty minutes. <laughs> oh, like yeah. for a pig. Yeah, yeah. Like 100%. how long you fucking come for thirty minutes? I just don't like guys minutes. after you come that want to make you come again. Like leave me alone. <laughs> Yeah, it's not going to be you, Leave buddy. Leave me alone. It's not going to be you. Horrible. Whoever, whoever set the stat, like whichever girl out there was like, yeah, a woman can have eight orgasms in one sitting. First of all, shut up. But also like I'm exhausted after. Please give me a minute. Yeah. yeah. Well, leave me alone. You know? Don't touch me. Girl talk. I know exactly what you mean. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so back to the first thing you would do as a, as a girl, you'd, you'd have an orgasm. Uh, I think that would be cool. <laughs> but I like, would, would you like, even know how to do it? Or anything I, feel like. Like that. I know like dudes like, I let my friend dog my me friend? out I'm like, what the fuck like yeah, that's mad weird that's that, what sucks. that actually reminds me not, a little <laughs> yeah. uh that reminds me of the question that people ask like, Peter's smirking in the corner just so you know <laughs> <laughs> but like if uh i remember people used to ask that question if like you're if your mom and your girlfriend like switch bodies mm. or like what or something like that mm -hmm. it's like your mom's body but your girlfriend's brain or your Girlfriend. Mom's brain in your girlfriend's body, like yeah. who are you smashing? And I'm like, you have to fuck Ew. one to switch. Whatever back. mind is not in my mom. <sighs> no, I <laughs> Wait, would what? fuck. I would fuck my boyfriend's mind in my dad's body because don't at least I'm admit not, that. No, but at least I'm not traumatizing my dad. I'm traumatizing myself. That's what I'm saying. Like, That's nice of you. Do you yeah. Know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, but but like. Your dad's older than you. He's gonna die before you. So like, you gotta live with it longer. But like, oh I'm not my. going home after that. Yeah, no. I could I could close my eyes and like pretend. Hundred percent. I'll role play some shit. You're smashing, I'll cook something up. You're smashing your dad though. Yeah, like Yeah, but you're smashing your mom. Yeah, in that's your fair. girl's body. Honestly, that's fair. Like that your is mom fair. is crying. You're, you're, first yeah, of all, you're, crazy. You're, you're banging up. And she's crying probably. Yeah, yeah, it's not. That's she's not. Like, Joey, stop. Also, like I got to go to Christmas and, and like, yeah. it's like, yeah, no, I don't I, like Once this. they switch back, the damage still stays. Do you watch Black Mirror though? No. There was a there was a thing where like are you familiar with the show? Yeah. So like they have this one episode where it's like 
it's like takes place in the future and they put this thing on the side of their head and they're like inside of like this video game and like you know mm-hmm. the mortal Kombat mm-hmm. video games where you're just like fighting each other or whatever so it's like you're in the game so you're fighting as this person but <laughs> this guy was playing the game with his boy he was a dude fighter and then the other guy was a woman fighter and then they realize like oh we don't have to fight we can we have like complete like autonomy of our bodies or whatever so they just start fucking each other and then it becomes this whole thing like wait is this is this gay and then it gets real dramatic and they like meet up outside of the game in the rain and they kiss each other okay peter you want to come on this episode <laughs> But I'm saying it's like, <laughs> I was, it's, it just reminded me of that where it's like, there's a lot of blurred lines. And- so my thing is like, if a guy hooks up with another guy, then he's officially considered gay to me. I IRL. mean, he could be bisexual. Yeah. But you'd be like, no, that's gay. A hundred percent. No, I think. I don't think a lot of like straight women will like the fact that like their man is like, I wouldn't up. care. If he's okay. hooking up with dudes too. I, well, okay. Well, if I'm dating him, it's still cheating. But oh, I'm saying, oh. like, if he would be like, "Yeah, like, I, I I'm have, bi." Oh, you like, see, I like that—that like that would bother me for sure. What are your thoughts? He's like, "Don't if I, me this." If I was, what am I doing? <laughs> no, you're right. <laughs> like, 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 I, I feel lying? like if he's dating a girl and a girl hooked up with a girl, it's fine. It's different. But that's a double standard. Hundred percent. You could be. Here we go. Let's switch topics. It's way easier for me to be like, "Yeah, yeah that's fine with me." It's sick. Um, but what I was going to say is speaking on that, yeah. um, if you would watch VR porn and fuck like a, you know, like those fake pussies, you yeah, know, like yeah, the fake yeah. like Here silicone things, yes. is that cheating? No. No. Uh, it's how the fuck? But you're, v- you're, v- you're like headset yeah. in, it's like real. But it's not a real person. But feels real. Yeah. Well, feels real, but it's not actually. I'm too afraid of those things, honestly. <laughs> Like, because I'm like, what if this is so fire? And then, like, sex is, like... Yeah, and, like, yeah. I don't want to ever be- become that. So, yeah. like, I can't do the flashlight thing. Like, I'd be too afraid Yeah. to be like, this is so good. Because, like, then scientists how- make this shit. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. they really worked on it to be like, they uh, we have optimized pussy. And I'm yeah. like, I don't want that. It's, like, better than average pussy, too. Probably. You know? I've also, to be fair, it never in my... Like, I don't understand this. And it's not like I've had sex with three people in my life. It's been more than that. He's like four. (laughs) It's been four. Three and a half. We're not going to explain that. But I've never ever had sex with someone and been like, that was whack pussy. (laughs) Like, it's like weird of like, like maybe it's like the energy of like, we just didn't really get on the same page. Yeah. But it's not like there's something wrong with the shit that you have. Right. Like I've never been like, this shit is whack. Right. Like that's never happened. Like Like, have you ever heard that like saying where people are like, it was like throwing a hot dog down a hallway. Uh, That can't like how that can't be. Yeah, I don't know. I just don't think that that could be. Also I've dated or people say that about women who've had kids before. (laughs) My friend uh he's now married to a woman who had a child when they met. Okay. And okay. he's never been like, yo. You know what yeah. I mean? Like, it's Shit's like loose, that. buddy. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's so funny because we just had our girlfriend on the podcast and she was saying that after birth, her vagina actually got smaller. Maybe. Because it was like... Yeah, vaginas are fucking crazy. Like, yeah. if you want to really get into the nitty gritty of it's fucking a muscle. vaginas, like, it's We're gonna insane. Be- <laughs> but, it, but it's actually a muscle. So people that are like, yo... Also, I don't get the idea of like body count of a hundred her pussy must be loose i'm like Here realistically though you could like smash a hundred people once or smash your partner a hundred times fuck the same person a hundred times or, or more it, than that or more than re- yeah. like i'm like them it's just the math ain't math yeah. yeah it's like yo, you have to assume that yeah. women who are in long-term relationships are having way more sex way, more. Yeah. <laughs> way more like yeah. wouldn't that make it worse it, by your like by knowledge? your definition, a yeah, by your knowledge. Percent. Also, all that shit just bothers me so much. Like I all, know. all of the fucking content a dude is just being like. Also, the balls to me is like crazy that a dude could actually go up to a random girl on the street and be like, "How many people have you fucked?" It's like crazy thing to I ask. No, like outside of a bar, it's like, God damn, dude! Like the fuck are you yeah. doing? But also, like if I'm with a guy who's counting, like I'm also like a yeah. guy with like a notes app with like a list of how many of people? like yeah, that's fu- 
first of all, you're a serial killer. Well, hold on. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, was yeah, a yeah, I, I do not have like, that. He's like, he's like, hold I on, pull that. out your phone. <laughs> no, I do not have that. That's crazy. Um, that, that would be, first of all, I would break up with you on the spot. If I, imagine you, you found a, guy, a thing. Oh, okay, imagine she would break, her. hold on, she would break up with him on the spot, but he, he's like at a massage parlor, like, she's Gucci. If he's just like stealing Wi-Fi to jerk off at work, it's like, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> but like this, Red I don't flag. know about that. No, but I know a that's girl, why our content never makes sense. <laughs> I know I know a girl that had a list like that and it was like a list of like every guy that she had hooked up with and some I feel of them, like it's definitely more acceptable for a girl, but no. But she had like everything like it was like too organized. I was like this is crazy. That's an Excel. But it was just like basically like oh I just made out with this person or I just okay. blew this dude or I like I had sex with these guys and I'm like what are you gonna do with this? Yeah. Like, what's the point of this? Like, is but, there a formula that we're like? But like, I feel like that's also like the type of girl who's just not gonna be chill. Well, imagine, you know what I mean? Imagine like everything you, know, you do is like pre-planned and it's not like a vibe. I just feel like if I was hooking up with someone and I knew I was getting like into a database after, and there was gonna be like some kind of like <laughs> a Veronica a pussy eight on ten. Yeah, right. Tits. Oh wow, could rating be like, everything. everything. You know what I mean? Like it's just like it could, could be, be better. better. <laughs> Veronica, <laughs> but tell me, you know what I mean? Like, if I was sleeping with you and I knew I was gonna be a part of a database, like you need to tell me this before. You're like, so I, I need to know I'm like my seven plus. <laughs> like, I need to know at least so I could I could come ready. I'll come yeah, with a right. fucking whip. Like, so <laughs> fucking. I want to get my. I don't think that up. makes the tits bigger though. It's not about like it's. <laughs> Simon yeah, Cowell's I might get like, a little rating there. Still. Didn't love it. <laughs> but like, first of all, if I ever found a, if I imagine you're going through your man's phone and you like, you do know, you guys do that? Both of you. All right. Um, I have, but I, I don't do that now. But you just haven't? haven't. In a bit? <laughs> like, I haven't. I, have, I, don't, I haven't done it yet. <laughs> like, I've been through my partner's phone for sure. Yeah. I have. I, I definitely have. And, and this is a bad habit, but if you pass me your phone, like I'll swipe down the notifications. But does that count as going through? I just want to like... Did she just say no? Did I say no? Yeah. That I don't go through people's yeah. phone? Sorry to be talking. I was sitting at a table when you took his Instagram. <laughs> With his permission, that's different. Wait, Wait what? That wasn't the question. Wait, what did you do? Ella, do you think the New York men they shave their balls? I mean, listen, they don't shave their chest. That I know. <laughs> <laughs> that's a really heavy stereotype to just give on all New York men. I'm not gonna speak for all New York men, but my experience. Well, maybe on your next day you could just bring them a little doggy bag of Manscaped products, and uh, that's a pretty nice thing to get as a guy. So. It's not a bad idea, actually, because, uh, listen, if you're one of those men, you should be joining the over 8 million men worldwide that are using Manscaped and keeping themselves nice, smooth, clean, trimmed down, smelling good. So use our discount code chemicalx at checkout to receive 20% off your entire order. If you have a boyfriend, if you are the boyfriend, if you have a sugar daddy, if you have a dad, weird gift, but also like, thanks, dad, you know? Use our discount code CHEMICALX at checkout to receive 20% off your entire order and free shipping. Everyone's winning. Your girl's happy. Your dad's happy. Your mom's happy, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> we, it was like, you know, it started off as a joke, first of all. Oh, it always, always does. Like, it, was okay. chill. it was chill. It was like, we were just like, Mad oh, and It always like, started chill. chill until it's like, who is that? It was, it was just thing to play. That's kind of what happened. Sure. Um, I was like, wait, I don't know. Like, I gotta stop this. It was a super biased thing, though. I don't care. Super wait, wait. Wait. I, I was, was chaperone. I, yeah, I wasn't off roading on his phone. It was like, uh, we're that sounded like right? an off road when you went swipe down. That's off road. That's off road. Oh, off. You want to try something else? What is that? It's, uh, it's supposed to be a Mae West, but a Mae West? It's called a Joe Louis. Yeah, it's Joe, Joe Louis. Louis. Wait, we didn't even. What the fuck is this? It was this? named like after him. Oh, it's true. Wait, what? Joe and Louis. Bring what what's your else? middle name? <laughs> Patrick. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Not that. Wait. It's really basic. <laughs> oh, it's just like a big fucking. It's like Try a little it. cake. Yeah. Okay. It's like a cake. It's chocolate. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna eat it first. Hold on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is like we have. Uh, don't do this. Ring dings. Or what's the <laughs> other one called? Something. Devil dogs. 
It's like that. But it's not like a big fat fucking Devil dog gel. sounds a bit. Yeah. Sus. They're like little like tubes. They're like dog shit, honestly. Oh. Okay, well I'm gonna but, stick with a Joe Louie. <laughs> these are good. It's whatever. It's the these same are- shit. Are you liking our snacks right now? I think you're liking the little snacks we brought you. I don't think I've eaten anything today. Wait. I've had a white claw, two shots of vodka, and a fucking Joe Lily. Like, that's my... <laughs> ask me Joe if I'm on a diet. Louis. Like, the fuck? This is what I've had today. I'm dead. I'm going to have a weird-ass fucking... Weird-ass cake. Okay, yeah, so you wouldn't go through your girl's phone ever. No. Nah. There's no reason you would ever. No. But... I, if I really felt like some shit was happening or whatever... I, I feel like there's just I don't know like a discussion could be had instead of me being like I'm gonna snoop yeah because I, I agree. would feel like such a bitch yeah to be like snooping I'm like yeah. I'm gonna find a thing like, and know your face because like it's, <laughs> no but like think about it, it's like the thing about how like I would think I look so crazy if I'm wrong yeah like if if the, if I'm wrong then I ha- then there's something in me that yeah but I have then to you change. close the phone and then everything's good. <laughs> Yeah. But I think it no depends who you're dating. Nobody knows if you do them while they're sleeping. I'm just worried that, not that I'm worried, but I'm like, if I'm wrong, then I got to like, there's something in me that I got to fix. Because like, how the fuck did I get here now that yeah. I'm looking through the phone, yeah. I'm doing this and that. Yeah. And like, I don't know. I'm not saying, like, I get it. A lot of people do that. Yeah. I just personally wouldn't because I like to think, and maybe I'm. this is naive, no, um, that, that like, if there is some sort of cause, then like there, I it's going to come out I regardless. Can get out, I can get it out of yes. a person via conversation. Yes. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? I don't know, but maybe I'm wrong. I don't think everyone's like that though. I think sometimes like, definitely not. Well, I'm a fucking idiot as we could see. And I, you could, <laughs> you could convince me of anything. So sometimes I think, I think I need to see for myself because <laughs> you could be like, nah, it wasn't true. I'd be like, mate. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I just don't feel compelled. Like, I think that there are things that I shouldn't see. Like, I still think that yeah. when you're with someone, like, you have your privacy, like, mm-hmm. you're your own person. And, and like, I don't want to see when you're talking shit about me to your friends or something, you know? Like, I don't think that's a bad thing. Like, yeah, of course you would say, like, yeah. yo, this kid's, yeah. you know, blah, blah, blah. Like, I don't need to know that. Like, just <laughs> be your own whatever. Yeah. Um, but if there's, like, something that is threatening the actual relationship, then I feel like that would kind of like, it would be way more obvious. I wouldn't and I have feel to like, like the look signs it. are kind of there regardless whether mm. you go on the phone or not. Yeah, yeah. you. Ju- I think that like yeah. people aren't necessarily looking for the thing like that uh, like ends the relationship. In my head, if you're looking through the phone, it's like or- kind of already over. Yeah. And you're just looking so you could be like, I'm not crazy. Look, yes. see? Yeah. Yes. But you can just make that decision anyway because if you're feeling so compelled that you're going to go through someone's phone, it's like, you're it's over like you ju- you already lost it and you 100%. don't need the you proof. lost the you can be trust. Like, i don't even need to see it because if like, you go through that like that you're like i'm gonna go through the phone it's because you already don't trust your partner yeah should i go guys like if you don't mind uh, should i just get the fuck, fuck out <laughs> <laughs> i feel like this became an intervention towards me yeah. no 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 i swear no. guys i never go it through only happened again. because of peter so you can get mad at peter yeah. later <laughs> but, but, but i don't think that it's like a crazy thing no but i don't think it's like a crazy thing like i don't like Every, like I think that most people probably do do mm-hmm. that sort of thing, or maybe a lot more won't admit that they have done it. Yeah. Um, but personally, I just like wouldn't. I don't know. Because you're a good person. I don't even think it's like that. Like I don't think it's like oh you're just a good you're guy. Or you have a lot of trust <laughs> and whatever. It's like I. It's it's more of like yeah. a selfish thing. Like I just yeah. don't see myself being. I just in a feel position like, like if like we're that. both on the rule of like you're not going through my phone. I'm not going through yours. Like it kind of just like balances out mm-hmm. again. Yeah. Like I, I would rather you have like yeah. your own space too. Like sometimes you need to figure some shit out on your own. And maybe that's like, that has nothing to do with me. Yeah. That's fair. Know. Okay. Okay. Well, look. Speaking of going through phones. Um, yeah. Here we go. <laughs> what do your DMs look like? I mean, I've been there. Yo, that's honestly, why you're here. I've been in your DMs. <laughs> uh, honestly. Uh, well, it is Pride Month, so there's a lot of uh, Peter Kennedy. Yo, I actually screen I actually screenshot uh, a DM the other day, and I was like, "This is crazy." Um, it was a dude named Jimmy, and Peter, he said, did you make a fake account? <laughs> <laughs> it was a dude named Jimmy, and he said, "I'd give you the wettest, most straight, sloppiest poke a hole in my throat, BJ, while I'm squeezing your nips." I wouldn't say shit. I'm just a hole, yours, sir. Bet I can beat any chick. That's been on y'all's dick, though. Try me. And then the emoji with the painted nails. 
<laughs> and I was like, damn, this dude just, that was like a, like a blowjob haiku that he just gave me. And it was just, it, I Poke was like, a I respect a hole in this. my throat? Yeah, it was like a straight. What, what did you, you answer? I didn't answer. I just, I just screenshot it and I was like, eh, I'm not going to do that. Because it was in like the, Wait. if you I accept mean, or deny shot. or whatever. You know, shoot it, your shot. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah. He's, he, he, he did give a sales pitch. Gay dudes, they that write was some crazy shit. That yeah. was detailed. Yeah. That yeah. sounded like he would actually be good. <laughs> I, uh, I while pinching your nips. Yeah. How, do you, <laughs> how do you? He made sure out. to put that in there. He's like, I'm going to. Don't worry. Those babies won't be forgotten. Yeah. You know? Like, Don't worry. I'm going to squeeze your nipples. Of course. Do you get a lot of weird shit like that in your DMs though? Yeah. There's a lot of weird stuff. But I feel like some some of it, I feel like people like do it on purpose. It's almost like a joke, like to get mm. like attention. To, to be get like, aired. I'm going to like say something crazy outlandish but it, it's not like that crazy like there are i also don't go through them that often these days like i try to stay off of instagram as much as i can because like <laughs> i just fall down into a rabbit hole sometimes it's like two hours i'm like the fuck am i doing in my day <laughs> so i try to stay off of it but um yeah do you I, know what a pay pig is pay pig yeah a of pay course pig. He's I don't like, like. Well, that one. Hey, that yeah. answered too quickly. No, the, reason why, the reason why I <laughs> said like, it like I have that. Five of those. No, the reason why I said that is because the I do a podcast called Other People's Lives, and we talk to people who like really get into these okay. types of things. So we yeah. talk to. I've heard like every possible fetish or way that you can earn money by being this or whatever, and like a pay pig is like, <laughs> yeah, it's not. those definitely exist out there. We, we have a lot of little piggies that like to DM us also. Really? But do you oink, ever get oink. pay pigs? One time I, I sold pictures of my feet because I was like, I you need sold? To. Yeah, yeah, I Wait, had to. Wait, I love I had Wait, to. you sold that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me, me and my friend Greg. So like, so like this is the, who I do the, the show with. Yeah. And we were like, um, we did a show on like a, some guy having a foot fetish and then people, some dude reached out to us and he's like, and then Greg was like, yeah, it would be really funny if we did this. And I was like, I was like, all right, cool. So we kind of like haggled this dude like going back and forth on how much he's going to pay for these feet. And uh, yeah, so I had to like lay down on the floor. He took Wait, no, pictures I'm of my dying. Feet. You did like yeah. soles of the feet? Yeah. Or like toesies? I think, no, it was like the soles like this, like straight on. Like looking at the bottom <laughs> Wait, of my feet. Wait, but how much did you get paid for this? I think it was like a hundred bucks or something. What? Yeah, yeah. I was just like, yo, because I just want to be like, yo, I'm a, reti- I'm a retired sex worker. <laughs> no, like, I'm that's dying. What, that's what I, I'm, I'm a retired sex worker. I sold pictures on my feet, got in and out, you know, got my money and then got the fuck out of there. And that's what happened. $50 a pop. <laughs> one for, that's what it is. One for yeah. the back. Yeah. I, I started higher, but it came down. I don't know. I, I ran into a, a pretty, someone who's like a veteran in the game. Clearly we'll get a lot of like, goddess, please just mention me on the podcast. Goddess, please. I'll send you and Veronica money. And I'm like, what is this? I don't know how, honestly, I don't know how women turn a lot of that down because there are dudes. Well, I've heard. Implying we turned down. We, <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean by turned down? Because yeah, wait, I'm like, turned down. I don't know. Nothing about that. <laughs> PayPal is Alessia dog. <laughs> by the way, shout out to foot fan yeah. one, two, five. <laughs> Appreciate you, man. No, I think the worst kind, well, the best kinds are like, here's my credit card. Like, just go crazy. That's crazy. That's and happens? I'm just like, yeah. hey, wait, but am I, am I being taken to the jail cell though? <laughs> yeah. Like, what is the approval? Have you spent money on a dude's card? Yes. Fire. Are you? No. <laughs> That's a yes. Uh, <laughs> Peter, he's like a lie for right here. She's wrong. I haven't. <laughs> Judges? He's like, so no one's ever giving me their card. Here's my card. Yeah. Do what you want. How much I money did you spend? Flights, like, What'd you buy? What'd you buy? A thousand nine once. Veronica's like, I don't think a I. A thousand nine? Know. Yeah. Like I booked like a thousand nine hundred dollars. That's fucking. That's more I than don't I don't think I've, I don't think I've yeah. ever said anything. That's but it's crazy. because you have patience and I have like no, no there's no patience. patience. To answer people. I have no patience. That's the thing. Give me the card or go home. Yeah, yeah. Pig. I'll literally be like, "You fucking loser! Are you giving me your credit card or not?" And then they it's probably like, love that shit. They love yeah. that. Yeah, they're like, and then the it's like, me. and then I'm like, "Well, where's your security code?" And then they'll send it. Okay, goddess. Okay, okay. That's can crazy. I oink for you? I'm like, fucking loser. There was a. Di- and then they'll be like, goddess, you spend way too much money, more money than I could have expected. Oh my god, I wasn't ready for this. I'm like, shut up and send me more. Damn, bro. He's like, I sold feet pics for a hundred bucks. Yeah, like I was trying to act cool and you make me look. You know what it is? I think it's actually because I have no patience. I'm just like, whatever. If you're gonna send, whatever, I'll try it out. You love dominating men. I don't love dominating men. I'm just good at it. Dominating those men. Not good at it. I mean, you're good at being. 
I'm just like, whatever. Like, if you're going to send, you're going to send. If you start being like, I'm not going to send, and you start making excuses, and I just don't answer. But, like, if I tell you to send and you send, then... Oink, oink, I guess. <laughs> oink, oink, I guess. That shit is fucking, fuck, He's fucking like, hilarious. Listen, I have another podcast. There was if a, you want there was a, Yeah, right? We yeah, can talk to you. Sorry. But we, we talked to this one woman, and she uh, had a bunch of uh, collars, as she Wait, called them. You know what's fucked up, though, is like sometimes they're like drinking or drugged up. I don't know if we can air this. <laughs> what? They are? Yeah. yeah. That's How do you know thing. that? Because I know. Because then in the morning, they'll be like, what the fuck? Oh. Okay, wait, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> they'll be like, oh, wait, shit. Wait, I got maybe? fucked up last night and became a pig. <laughs> <laughs> and I sent $2,000 to some wait, random girl. Wait, aren't pigs the one that come for 30 minutes? <laughs> I, I mean, I guess why they chose pay pig. Yeah, but yeah. Like, it all makes sense. Anyway, maybe we should have done this. That's crazy. Mm. You're like, what are you doing, Jamar? You want to come on my podcast? <laughs> No, but we talked to this girl and she said that she had like collars, which are dudes who are like monthly, basically like subscribers of her. <laughs> and she has a fiance and she said that she knew she was getting engaged or something and was like telling them uh, that like, oh, my boyfriend's going to, you know, whatever. So they were like. Boyfriend's going to what? Like in uh Propose to her. Yeah. Okay. And they were like giving her money to give to him to go towards the ring. Like, isn't that nuts? Yeah. yeah but they, for sure. But they'll be like, what? I want to pay your dinner, but also who's the alpha male that's with you? I want to pay for him too. They want to know that Yo, it's She's it's got an empire. Nuts. You know, Wait, nuts. You just got an empire. No. Yeah. You got I just dudes. like want like what? Like sometimes that <laughs> yeah, so no, I don't think I got chance. here. <laughs> but I think they get off on the fact that it's like they could never be Yeah. That of course. And then they're like, "Oh my god, alpha male. Oh my god, I could yeah. never be yeah. that." And it's I'm like, like "Well, you're really exactly. for another man." Yeah, it's of course. so fucked. We we posted a TikTok Speaking about pay pigs, and then, like, I don't know why my account was filled. I don't know why my account was I filled mean, with just, like, fucking oinkers. So they were damn, just, Damn, you like, gave them a name, too. That's crazy. <laughs> no, they're just, like, piggies, like, <laughs> coming through in my the DMs. And, and they're like, can I please send you money? And I'm like... Yeah. But I mean, I'm like, yeah. what? I'm going to say no? No, like, that's hey, what I'm saying. If I'm in a relationship, okay, I'm not answering. Oh, I, I would even be like... I don't know. This is no, I'm not. If I'm in a relationship, I'm not answering. But if I'm single, I'm like, okay. PayPal I is. I think there's a leeway there to be like, babe. Yeah. I, I, I feel like that's disrespectful, though. <laughs> to an extent. Oh, okay. I'll let you want to talk about this. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> shut up, you stupid bitch. Yeah, shut up your money. fucking card. No, I'll just shut up and you guys can talk now. No, no. <laughs> I really didn't want to go this route. Damn. Uh, yeah, I know. I pulled on that string way too much. Yeah. I'm sorry. So you sold feed pics. Yeah, I did. Would you ever sell nudes? Hell no. Really? Nah. No. Well, I mean, you're selling feed pics for a hundred. I know, but that was like for okay, a like joke. 10K. What about a thousand nine? No, no, no. No, I'm not. Million. No, I'm not. So <laughs> I'm not yeah, motivated but then by your money rep at all. Is done. No, I'm not motivated by money up. at all, though. Like for anything. So like okay. it, that, it would never be something like that. CEO but like. Joe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like that's a, <laughs> it's funny because Frank you, Frank makes it seem like I that's all I care about is fucking money, but it's like the op. And then Greg will tell you otherwise. He's like he hates money, so like I don't know how both those things exist, but clearly Frank is full of shit. I feel like you're afraid of us with these pills. <laughs> that he's just like he's like anyways. No, I'm just like a fidgeter. <laughs> so you never sell a new no okay okay billion dollars. Billion dollars. Okay, well, yeah. that, like, hold on. That's I'll, a big job. I'll have my mom proofread. Okay, wait. Does this look good? <laughs> like, the fuck? <laughs> no, yeah. Have you ever had, like, any celebrities in your DMs? Do you yeah. Do you need another white claw? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. need... That was a really I'll long I'll take thing. that white claw now. <laughs> uh, yeah. But nothing like... Like, no one that I'll you're like, one. this is crazy. No, I mean, like, nothing... No, there's been moments where it's like, oh, this is, you know... This is kind of nuts, but like nothing that was like, f- like sexual or something like that. Oh, just no. like, yeah, that's I don't know because we <laughs> like were just talking were... about you know something else. I'm like, no, I don't think like there's never been an interaction that I've had with someone who's like, thank you. Um, what the fuck is this? <laughs> what is it? Grapefruit. Is that how you say grapefruit? Pamplemousse. What the fuck Pamplemus. is that? Wait, wait. That's grapefruit. In Do French. you know how you say nipples in French? No. Nah. You want to take a guess? Nope. <laughs> you think it's nope or you don't no, want to make it? No, it's not. I'm, I, like it, it could be like nipple. You know, like that's what I would guess. So what is it though? Mamelon. 
Why did I not even know that? Yeah. Mamelon? Mamelon is nipples in French. Why? Okay, wait, I but boobs is saint? What does yeah. that have to do with grapefruit? Just as a weird word. Oh, I was yeah. just thinking about yeah. the fact that mamelon. Monica, you, you good? I am good. I'm just thinking about the fact that I find that if so weird. If you wanted to wear a top that showed your titties, you could have done that. I didn't. I don't have any to show. I don't have so, any to show. <laughs> I told you what my rating is on the Excel sheet. It's could not be great. better. <laughs> could be better. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Where's that we... rating sheet? I'd like to see mine. So, so uh, no, good, no good celebs in your DMs? Or like no one that was like a fan of you that you were like, I can't believe that you're. Well, I worked with like The Rock and apparently he was like a fan of mine. And that was like you're some like, years wait, ago. I'm a fan of you. Yeah. I was like, this is crazy. And he was actually like the coolest dude in the world when I met him. Because like they he like when he first started uh, his YouTube channel, he wanted me to host this thing that he had. And they were filming it in L.A. for like three weeks. And I was like, I don't want to do that. Like, I don't want to go to L.A. for three weeks because there were so many things that I was doing. So I was like, nah. And wait. then. They were like, he really wants you to do it. Like, what if we came to New York? And I was like, oh, if you guys are in New York, yeah, for Jesus. sure. Jesus. So the wait, came. The Rock is like moving you? mountains? Yeah. Well, no, no, no. He, well, you have like a cake cake and it's The Rock. You have the... <laughs> no, no, no. That's not... I'm not trying to make it seem like he, you know, blah, blah, blah. They were filming in L.A., and then I was like, I don't, I can't really do that. I don't want to go to L.A. for we three weeks. We need to weeks. talk about why you hate L.A. so much, because like... yeah. Okay, hold on. He's like, yeah, I'm we not can. the biggest fan of LA. Yeah, I hate that shit. Um, <laughs> okay, why? Um, and to be fair, like I, I would go back and I like plan on it, but oh, this is I so like, sad. I just like I don't would go back for hiking or something. No, no, no. Like, <laughs> every time I've went, the people that I've met are just like so caught up in like the social media mm-hmm. thing, and. I have been, I mean, it's ironic because I don't listen to podcasts. I don't watch YouTube, like YouTubers or anything like that. You just post on your own. Yeah, like I just do the thing and like I just, that's it. Like my Mm -hmm. life exists uh, like otherwise. But people are so wrapped up in it and they care so much about it and I just don't. And I feel like people in New York don't either. Yeah. So it, I feel That's more why I love here. New York. Everyone yeah. just like, they don't give a shit about you. It's just like yeah, fast paced exactly. environment. Yeah. I just don't like yeah. to, you know, when people are like asking like, Oh, so how, like are asking about like followers or they like bring that up as a talking so point weird. when talking about other people. And I'm like, who gives a fuck dude? Mm. Like, you know, it's like yeah. weird. And I, cause the reason why I was out there, I, I went there like maybe f- I think three or four times but it was when I was working for this uh, company and I had this like series that I was shooting. So I was with, I was purposefully around people who had like some sort of following because they were going to be in these videos that we were doing. And like those people, I just didn't really enjoy. I had weird interactions with mm. them. And, but it's funny because every single person that I've met that actually has like a big following hasn't been like that. It's always people that have like something, but nothing crazy. And they act like they have like an assistant. They have mm-hmm. like all like, oh, send this email to my assistant. And it's like, yeah. I'm literally talking to you right, <laughs> right. now. Yeah. Like, why am Don't I just sending answer. it? Yeah, like just say something to me. Um, so I, like it just rubs me the wrong way that like yeah. people out there like care about that type of thing. And like, like no my, one talks about shit. Yeah, yeah, I feel like my experience with that is like anyone who was like born in L.A. is more normal than anyone yeah. who's like left wherever they were from to go to L.A. and be someone. They get yeah. caught up in the scene and then they become this like. I think it's just yeah. a little bit competitive and it's cutthroat too. So I think I think you have to be your environment in a way sometimes. And I feel like that's just the environment in LA where it's very competitive yeah. and it's like who has more followers. So I've been on some to bad give them, in LA. Like to give bad. them, you know, that that kind of yeah, you know, benefit of the doubt. Can I, I ask you guys just, a question? Sure. So Well, this is your podcast, so. (laughs) I'm sitting in the middle. It's my podcast. Like, you guys having a good time? Appreciate you coming on. Uh, Like, and I want you to be, like, truthful. If you're going out. we're being truthful. We went pay pigs and all. (laughs) Yeah, we did go pigs. Yeah, the pig pen. If you're going on a date with someone, Mm -hmm. uh, and it's like, okay, um, we're going to this restaurant at 8 o'clock or whatever. Okay. And. I'm so on guard. I'm like, okay. No, no, no. So, like, so how are you getting there? Well, he's picking me up. Well, what if he's he doesn't have a car? Then a lot of people in New York don't have cars, though. Yeah, send me an Uber. Uber. Okay. He's like, oh, no, 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 this, I'm this asking. This girl's a red flag. No, 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 no I mean, I'm I not think... saying that. I'm, I'm genuinely asking because I don't, I don't know. 
Like, I just don't know. But like, I will say, I think it's different from place to place. So I don't know about New York, but in Montreal, I feel like it's very much no, like the I culture. No, I am in LA, New York. Send, I'm just saying. Send me give, a car and then send me home in a car too. Like, send me an Uber, pick me up in an Uber or pick me up. In Montreal, everybody has a car. So it's very like, okay. I'll pick you up, whatever. Yeah, yeah but still, they sometimes send. I just think it's like a, a, a But you would never like do. get yourself there. If I was already out. You went on a date in LA where you took an Uber there. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's what, what I'm I mean. saying. So you, okay, you yeah. have done it. Yeah. But it's not, a, it's like a turnoff. Well, no, it's already like blacklist. <laughs> so this day, no matter how good it's like, fuck this blacklist, shit. Blacklist, for sure. Okay. It's like a courtesy thing. You think it's chill? Sorry, I totally nah. forgot about it because I was like, no, he yeah. was going to pick me up, but he didn't. No. Wait, what? But exactly. He said that he was going to pick you up yeah, and then? All right, exactly. that's different. That's like. But like, are you like, I think it. you should pick the girl up or send her yeah, a what are your or thoughts? like it's chill? Like we can um, meet there. He's like, well, I'm going to be so, blacklisted here. And no, no, no. <laughs> I don't even, I mean, I don't care. Well, you know what? I was talking to one of my friends from L.A. And he was like, well, Alessia, like sometimes in L.A. the way it is, it's like they don't want to feel like you're like a serial killer. Like I'm going to pick you up. Like they rather just like meet you there. Mm -hmm. And I get that, too. Mm -hmm. But like I feel like being Canadian, it's like either pick me up or send me an Uber. Mm -hmm. That's how yeah. I see it. I, so I. <laughs> He's perking. No, no, no. I'm not. I'm not at all. I, my personal opinion, I mean, I, Pick I, me up. I prefer that than an Uber. If we're like going to a place, like I think like two stopping an Uber makes sense. Like if I'm getting in an Uber, then like I'll two stop the Uber. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, okay. What if I'll you're pick walking you to the place? <laughs> Walk, I want to know where this is going. Walking to He's the, like, no, if I'm getting this, in an Uber, no, because the reason what why if I'm you're asking, not? The reason why I'm asking is because a friend of mine was in LA okay. and he uh, was going on a date with some girl and before he could even offer anything, she was like, oh, you can just send a car at this time. And I just thought, like, that to okay, me was that? like, I don't like that. Yeah. I don't like that because it feels like you're already expecting it. That's what I mean. A hundred percent. Like, I'd rather, like, see who you are and, like, what you're going to do. Right. So that I can make my judgment off of, like, mm -hmm. what type of guy you are. Yeah, like. Like, I'll take an Uber, no problem. But in the back of my mind, I'll be like, oh, okay, didn't... like, I don't fuck with this right, guy. Yeah. yeah. But what if the But, dude... like, I'm judging, but. But what if the dude also, like, was really nice, paid for the meal, and then also, like, paid for your Uber home? You'd still be like, but I got I here. think getting but the I Uber think home I... makes sense, though. I think that would, like, save it. But if you were also, like, see ya, and then I'm, like, ordering my that's Uber. That's weird to me. That's weird. Yeah, that's very strange. You could definitely my... save the meet me in an Uber there if you Uber me home. So, that's the thing. I don't, <laughs> like, <laughs> so when he was telling me about the situation, I was like, I, like, really didn't like that because of the expectation. Yeah. The expectation came off like weird to I get me that. like let me offer it and if i don't offer it and then you, you can and have you like, don't fuck with that they're yeah. like okay that's fine yeah um yeah, but like I, I don't know i get that and also if i'm if we're on a date and I, obviously like i'm paying and then obviously if i'm seeing you in front of my face and we're on a date i will pay for your uber home <laughs> or something you know what i mean but if we're in different places and it just either doesn't come up in conversation or whatever. Or it's like, we just settled like, oh, it's going to be at 8 o'clock at this place, whatever. It's like, cool, send my Uber at this time. I'd be like, hold on. <laughs> I don't know about this now. Like, yeah. I don't know. I think demanding Ooh. for anything. I think even like I just don't want to demand. I just like, I feel like it should saying, be like. It's something you would like and you can make I'm not going to be like, hey, like you didn't do. send. Like, but I'll, in the back of my mind, I'd be like, oh, yeah. like, why didn't he though? Yeah. Yeah, he's like interesting. No, no, no. I, I, and I don't think that. I you're, don't think you're there's, getting to know a girls. But life. you can't force courtesy. Like for me to say, oh, send won't. an Uber. It doesn't matter whether and you like do it or And like you said, like in I LA, asked. I just called myself an Uber and it was yeah. fine. But like I was in the Uber, like, mm, is this guy a gentleman? Yeah. Like, would I date was this he? guy? No. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> there you go. But that's what I mean. I feel like the flags girls are always there at the beginning. Like, Joe's like, send Uber. No, no, no. Like, <laughs> I feel like from the beginning, if someone's like a gentleman, you'll know. Mm -hmm. Like, I feel like that was the first flag to many. Mm -hmm. You know? I don't know. Yeah. But, it, but it could also be one that could be saved. Like, like you're saying, if you get the Uber home, then it's like, okay. Especially for a first date. But every guy who's ever gotten me an Uber home got me an Uber there, going. Yeah. So it's like, but Makes I sense. hear what you're saying. It's like, where are you? Like, yeah. what are you even doing before? Like, we'll just meet there and then like see the vibe. Yeah, I guess it's just like the expectation to me would be like. Well, I, w I, that's I think different. that's what's fucked up. Yeah. yeah. I would never be like, okay, well, send me an Uber. I just Uber. think it's unclassy, actually. Yeah, I thought it was But also, like, it's mean to put a girl through that. Like, is he going to send it? Like, just be straight up at the beginning. 
Yeah, I don't know that there was enough time to like <laughs> to oh, say. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't think he was making her sweat. He didn't. He yeah. He didn't get a chance to offer. Yeah. So that's where I think it's like. But that's fucked up. I to think be it's like, okay hey, to be send like, me an Uber at there? this time. You know what's interesting about that? If it was me and that happened, I would be on the date, similar to what you just said, and I'd be like. This is going well, but why did she say that? Yeah, why yeah, did she say send like, me an Uber? Like, why like, is she like, be... oh, send it at this time? Like, I'm her, like I'm a fucking yeah. valet guy, yeah, yeah, yeah or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. You know, like have my car ready. <laughs> I'll be ready at seven forty-five. It's like, yeah, that's all right. Weird. Chill. I prefer in a perfect world, the the perfect thing is you pick me up. But then again, yeah. it's like we're drinking, but also we'll figure it out from there. No, but not everybody yeah. has a car. I oh, mean, you're saying in an Uber. I hear you. Yeah. Uber or just car. I just think it's be courteous, but also be classy and don't demand things. You know what I, I mean? think if you're asking for it already, it's not something that that person was like going to do. No, in that case. And that's so, sure then, ruins so then that's like, it ruins you don't that. have enough self-awareness to know that like that wasn't but happening. But like, was your friend going to send her a car or pick her up? Uh, I, I don't know that. I just know that he like sent this and he was like, because he just like sent a, a screenshot of her text and he was like dating in LA. Yeah, but I just think like after, like for me, if I would be like, oh send God. me a car. So like if it, so if it was me and I was going to, that yeah. would be, I'd be like, would ruin fuck, it. this ruined it. Yeah, like yeah. I was trying to do a nice thing and like now it just doesn't even matter because it was yeah. like expected. Like expected. it's not me doing a nice thing anymore. It's just mm -hmm. me doing a thing. You know thing. what I always it's think? Just it's just you like, doing what you need to be doing. It's yeah. like and men it's like, need to feel like they're making the decision regardless if they are no not. because that at the end of the day no matter what is like a favor like i am paying money so that you can get there yeah. but if you're gonna be like you should do this it's like no it's i'm fucked. still like doing a nice thing though. yeah yeah but now you're like taking away 100%. i'm getting something from this of being like okay i'm paying this money and getting you there but at least i get the satisfaction of knowing like i did a general like a but gentleman it's the thing. Same thing as it also just dinner. feels. <laughs> it also just feels very transactional, and that's like a weird feeling. I think oh, can I ask you a different question too? I think. This sorry. Is like, well, this I mean, is like it's your podcast, so please go no, ahead. But I think it's the same I'm thing as paying dinner. Okay. <laughs> I think it's the same thing as paying dinner. I think like even though you can expect that the guy's gonna pay, I still think you need to be like classy and courteous and like appreciative. Thank you. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I feel differently about that. Like to me, I feel more like there shouldn't even be a conversation. Like the dude should pay for the date. Like, I don't think that, I don't, like, I don't think that there's, like... But, like, you don't expect, like, a girl to be, like, thank you? No, of course. Okay, but it's that's like, what it's, she's it's saying. it's an expectation, but you're still appreciative, and you're still, like, giving the satisfaction, okay. like, thank you so much for taking me out for dinner, yeah. even though you kind of expected it to happen. Of course. Which I think yeah. is the same thing with the ride. It's, like, even though you're kind of expecting to be picked up, I still think you shouldn't be, like, send me a car. Like, like you shouldn't be, like, yeah, the bill's going to him. I think that would be, like, well, I was gonna well, do nobody, it, but fuck nobody, off, really, yeah, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah. I was going to her, actually. But I do think that the dinner is more expected than the Uber there. Than the Uber. Yeah, that's fair. Like, I think the Uber there is, like, okay, the fair. biggest, like, gesture you can do. If we're calculating... Because yeah. the other ones are more I expected. mean, if we're calculating, absolutely, yeah. dinner first. Yeah. For sure. And then What's Uber home question? and then Uber there. My other question was, have you guys ever split a dinner bill? Never. No. And okay. I would say I'll, I'll pick up the whole bill. Yeah. Nice. Power How move. big's your dick, Veronica? Huge. Is it circumcised? I don't know. Whatever's bigger. <laughs> if it looks bigger, then circumcised. <laughs> if it looks uh, bigger, circ, then circ, because I have a huge dick. I'll pick up the whole. <laughs> Whichever's no, because, bigger. You know, no, that's not what that means. It's like you trying to prove a point. I get it's it. It's me trying to prove. I but it's you. also like I could pay my dinner, but if you're going to take me out and you're going to expect like some kind of like we're but going 50-50. But some guys will be like, like if you initiate the date, then should you be paying the date? I wouldn't initiate the date, though. 100%. <laughs> I'm just saying. I mean, yeah, 100%. You're, you're gonna, uh, I mean, I might as well put you in doggy style after if I'm initiating <laughs> and paying and getting my Uber there. Come put on. your strap on. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Holy shit. That's funny. Wait, have you ever split a day? Hell no. No, I, I just get, I would get too embarrassed. With like sometimes in the past, like uh, with girlfriends, like on my birthday, They'll be like, okay, all right, I'll pay. I'm like, all right, cool. But like, even then, I'm like, oh, like, yeah. yeah. Can I hold your card and give it to him? Because like, I feel like <laughs> I such an that. asshole. I get that. Like, I, I feel get like it. such a weird. I feel like, like, like oh, it's like my the birthday. One. That's why she's yeah. doing this. But but I think I think it's still nice for like a girl to do it every once in a while. But if you're in, if you're like dating, and it's like you go out yeah. to like a fucking whatever we had like two beers and like fucking blah 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 it's like oh i got it don't worry about it. like no i think on your like birthday whatever. it's like i feel like some guys like for me and we we had made a made a podcast about this we were talking about how like if a guy splits the bill it just tells me like you're not really serious because you're not even willing to like take me out for dinner to get to know me so it's like you kind of just want to like you're not that seriously into me because you won't even pay for my dinner so it kind of tells me like where's your intentions 
And then other, like, people's arguments are like, well, if I have to, like, you know, invest in everyone before I get to know them. I think that you're right, though. Like, yeah. I think that, like, your intention, no one's asking you to take every girl yeah. out to dinner. That's what like, I'm saying. I'm like, like why just you take so the girls easy? out to dinner that you want to take out and to dinner. And you know what? This is what I say. It's like, a guy will go on a date with a girl and he'll, like, split the bill. But it's like, you tell that guy, okay, now take your, who's your dream girl? Fucking Emirata. You're taking Emirata on a date. Emirata out on a date. And you're going to tell me you're not paying for her bill. Mm -hmm. I guarantee you that guy is going to be like, I'll, I'll pay for anything yeah, she right, wants. Because yeah. it's like, that's your dream girl. So for me, with that mentality, it's like, okay, well, if you're not even willing to pay for my mm -hmm. dinner, that's because you don't regard me in a way where it's like, I'm like, I'm like, wow, like you're somebody that I would like to be with. Right, yeah. Because you no, would do I, that for your dream girl. I agree. I think that's fair. I think that's yeah. fair to, to like kind of expect that. And I think that like that is like, I don't know. I don't like, I feel like I just have too much pride to be like, <laughs> I'm going to split this shit or like, I'm going to, but then whatever. it's like, why Silence you while you're had two too. drinks? I had three, like oh, that, whole, that, that whole, but that whole conversation would just give me like so much anxiety. But you're going to watch yeah, me pay the that's bill. That's crazy. I think in a perfect world, a guy gets up and like, he, like the girl doesn't even like witness the bill. Do you handled. see, you ever see those TikToks where it's like, <laughs> it's like the guy's like, what kind of man would watch his girl pay for the bill? <laughs> and it's the guy, it's the yeah. camera turns around. He's, yeah. like, <laughs> he's like this. <laughs> Like, yeah. oh, I'll watch it. <laughs> but like even with friends and shit, if we go out to dinner or something, I, bro, I'm not sitting here like five cards or whatever. It's, I think that's a Canadian thing too. You guys have separate bills and shit. Yeah, we could do separate bills. In New York, we don't it's do like that one. Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah we, it's, it's one, one bill. Like whoever wants to pay it, like you're getting the points on your card or whatever. So it's yeah. like one fucking bill. We're splitting this. Like yeah. I don't give a fuck if you had a glass of water. Mm -hmm. Like you're sitting at the table, like. I mean, if you're not going to eat, that's different. But, like, it doesn't matter what you buy, how many drinks you had, whatever yeah. the fuck the case is. Like, you're not we're start splitting the, this the thing. Fucking, but I yeah, also start think, counting. And, yeah. Uh, like, nah. Yeah. I'm not no. doing that. I don't know. Okay, so crazy. send an yeah. Uber only if the girl's not expecting it. Dinner is fully paid. If you're vibing, then you send an Uber back. What if you're not vibing? What do you I would do? still do it. I would still do it. But I, okay. I also think that, like, uh, knowing me, and maybe this is wrong, I don't know, but if I was to um i don't think that i'm like compelled every single time to send an uber there there okay because i know how i am it's like i know i'm picking up this bill i know i'm gonna send you back in an uber and i know like okay. if there is future dates i'm picking up like, like i'm going yeah. to do the right thing so like it's almost <laughs> which is maybe this is but not it's good. just one more step joe it's i know one but more maybe step that's just, but that's the thing like if there is an expectation, we just agreed that it would be negative. A hundred percent. But so like, like we're not you, a, but like, so, you wouldn't okay, like so the like, type of person that. You have an expectation. I have an expectation. So like we're, something's got to give. But you know what it is? It's that you know how you are, but we can only judge based off how oh, you're exactly. exactly. So, so as a woman, for me, and even yeah, as a man. For me, it's like, no, I know, you I know. haven't met me yet. So we don't know if we're going to vibe. So like you just need to do like the initial step in order for me to be like, okay, this guy's a true gentleman. And then, you can act accordingly, but like, yeah. for example, like the guy in LA who did that, like going forward, if he didn't, I would have just been like, sorry, like something came up, like I'm yeah. not going. I would never be like, oh my God, I'm expecting an Uber. I, I'm Canadian, I'm too nice for that. But like, I would just be like, <laughs> I eat Smarties and ketchup chips. I'm Canadian, I'm too nice for that. Shut up, you stupid fucking pig. <laughs> <laughs> you pig, $1,900. Everyone's, I just think everyone's judging based off like not knowing the person. So we just could take what we could take. So that's why I think as a girl, you're like, okay, he's not even sending me an Uber. Like, what if he's going to fucking split the bill with me? So yeah. we're just like 100%. trying to gauge. It's like, I, I think don't, we're trying to gauge. I don't know you enough to know like what the vibe is yeah. going to be. So like, do... The yeah. bare minimum in order. To <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's the, it's you know? different with everyone. I mean, but like if a don't... girl is like, send me an Uber, then I'm like, I'm not down either. Oh, I get yeah. that. that. That's was, like, hey, yeah. okay, yeah. relax. I was going but to, but like now it's like, bitch. I bought your dinner. Fuck me now. Like, let's go fuck. Mm -hmm. It's the transaction. It's like the I did this for you. Now you do this. It's like, okay, I'm wait. On as a, date. a guy, do you expect if you do everything right, send an Uber there, pay for dinner, um, vibing? Do you expect to fuck her? Nah. Fuck her. Nah. We know you're hammered, but yeah. she's a <laughs> fucker. You know, like Would you fucking fuck her? Would you smash that <laughs> pussy? Okay, uh, uh, no, no, no. I think that's crazy. I, I actually don't even think that. Like, I mean, wait, do, would you if they would be wanting to? What would you? Would you? Would you the the yeah, Sorry, I, I, don't, I don't want to say fuck. I know it's no. not loud here. Fuck. <laughs> would you? No, no, no. Yeah. Of, I would mean, you gently bend her over? <laughs> 
Would you bent poke her the bear? Over. She, she tried to clean it up. Like, <laughs> yeah. Bend her over. I wasn't trying to clean it up. Sink. Um. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think that, like, it would just be, like... If the a, vibes are the vibes. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Like, I think that, like, this is why... The reason why I'm asking is because, like, all this content, like, exists on the internet now of, like, kids who are, like, fucking 21 or 22 years old, like, going out on the street and asking people, like, their body count, this mm-hmm. and that. And then also asking, yeah. like, if you... Like, these assumptions, like, if you fuck on the first date, then it's, like, you're this. Yeah. And blah, blah, blah. It's, like, all these interactions are very individual. And yeah. it's, like, different and situations. Pers- yeah. I have, like... Have you ever dated a girl that you fucked on a first date? Um, He's like, I want to say what I want to say, but no, no, no. He's that like, it's going to go against no, I don't. No, I don't think I have. I think it's situational. But so also, ladies, like, I'm, situational. I'm not, like, I'm also very... You slept um, with four people. Yeah, I've slept with three and a half people in my life. <laughs> well, what's the three and a half? Was it Peter? <laughs> <laughs> Peter's one and a half. <laughs> yeah, he's like <laughs> six, five. And I just think it's situational. But I just think... Also, like, when stuff like that has happened... Um, like in my life, it, I, I'm also very like, um, I talk a lot. So it's like communication is like whatever. So like I, there's never been, a, I've never had like a one night stand and like ghosted somebody because yeah. I feel horrible. Like I'm yeah. never just going to like start oh ignoring God, people. So I, I mean, mean it's, yeah, but it's, but it, you know, it doesn't have, it's not like I'm doing like a crazy nice thing in my head. I'm like <laughs> avoid, but also to, uh, to manage expectations. There are people who like, I know I wouldn't date this person, so I'm right. not going to pretend like I would to have right. sex with them. Yeah. Yeah. I would just make my life like way a living hard. hell to now I have to like figure out how to get out of this thing. Like, right. That to me sounds like way more work than just being like, I don't think that we're on the same page as far as this goes. But if you think this person is attractive or whatever the fuck, like I think it's easier to do that so that if something like that happens, the it's easier to kind of like go your separate ways or, or whatever, but I don't, yeah. I've never like ignored somebody or like ghosted. Yeah. I don't, I don't think I'm not a, I'm not a ghoster. I'm a people pleaser. I'm a ghoster. Yeah. She's a ghoster. <laughs> she's like a, she's like, why do I have to explain why I don't like you? You should just know. I get that too. Right. Like, and then what I, ex- hold on. I explain myself. I read a whole Bible, why it's not going to work. And then the person goes like, relax. I just wanted to fuck you. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, I think it's like, do you get yeah. what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I put my heart on the line of why it's not going to work, and yeah. then what? Like, no. It's yeah. the same thing. I don't thing. feel like I need to give you an explanation. It's yeah. Like early on, it makes sense. I get it. Yeah, because, like, when you're it, when it feels like, oh, I've, I'm over-explaining now, and they're like, chill. Like, yeah. relax. <laughs> yeah. Like, like, when, like, if you're in a relationship and someone's talking to you, and it's nothing, like, crazy. It's not like a, you know, you're just in a, there's someone standing next to you at a bar or something, and whatever you guys are in a conversation it's not like you're gonna jump down their throat and be like uh, i have a boyfriend and you're they're like 100%. all right cool like, yeah like no one asked <laughs> yeah like I, I remember being i was at a fucking i think holiday it's actually party. healthy to be like it's just like have a if conversation yeah. like if there is some sort of like advance and it's like oh like yeah you know, this and i think that know? goes with like you know being able to like go out on dates with your partner and just like you know make your partner realize that like you know um, Go ahead. Say I'm, the toxic thing. I, no, yeah. no, no, no. It's not yeah. toxic. It's just like you're lucky to have me and I'll be respectful, but like... Other people want me? I mean, it's not really... I, I think, think everyone wants that, though. I think, yeah, th- yeah, yeah. I think that that's what dates are for, though. It's just to remind Wait, yourself... You hold on. It's just date? to remind yourself of like who you're with. Yeah. Right? So up. it's like if somebody's like talking to you, it's like, but that's my girl. Like, yeah, I'm obviously yeah. not going to like... Mm-hmm be a fucking bitch but like i'm gonna have a conversation but i'm yeah. gonna be respectful obviously yeah shut how, up you stupid how, pig how do you think <laughs> <laughs> i'm gonna be respectful to people who don't have 1900 dollars for me <laughs> uh, i'm looking so bad this episode <laughs> um how do you feel though about like a guy if you're dating a guy and like an- another dude is like talking to you or whatever like do you expect him to like come up and be like bro no, I will. I That's will literally so f- cringe. Turn off. Yeah. It's such a turn off. Like respect me energy. and under- so- understand that like I'll be able to handle my own and yeah. like. But I think we're that's, good. I think it's so attractive if like you can give me the space to deal with my shit. Yeah. If you see Look, something, if it's getting out of hand, then you're like, hey, yeah, step in. But like, if you could be like, I know that that's my girl, and I'm not threatened by this person. Right. That's yeah. like, damn. Yeah. Let's go home. You know what I mean? Like, it's 100%. like, it's, I think it's hot. I think it's hot if you could, like, trust me to, like, deal with my own shit and, like, right. let me handle it. Yeah. A guy yeah. who's like, yo, 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 that's my girl. Like, <laughs> yeah, why don't yeah, you yeah. know that your girl's going to say that she's in a yeah. relationship? I, I've been in those situations, too, where that's that happened. It's like, this bar 
is tiny. <laughs> your girlfriend's here. You're with her. You think she's cheating on you? Like yeah. right there? Yeah. yeah. Like that's wild. But it's like, and those people are always the type of people to be like, it's not you I don't trust. It's like everyone else. I hate when yeah. people and say like, that. You don't up. trust your girl then. You don't like, I could fight. doesn't matter who you don't trust. Yeah. But also like, I mean, oh, you're that's like, those? what? Like it's everyone else I don't trust. No, 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 not at yeah. all. But I'm saying when he you're doesn't s- go through phones, we're Gucci here. When, when you're saying <laughs> that, though, when you're saying like it's not that I don't trust you, I just don't trust guys. It's like, but what are you like? So you're like thinking I'm gonna be like sexually assaulted by everybody? <laughs> yeah. Like that's what it's you're like. like you I I'm, just think it's like you can't handle your own. Yeah, you just think that I'm yeah. uh, that I can't. And it's like, look, like I'm able to handle myself. That's with actually or very mature, you. by the way. That's not very toxic of you guys. Right. Yeah. Because you're if, not toxic, if I, I swear. no, there are women though that are like who would just not do that and like would like would want a guy who's going to step in and like and for, for those kind of situations yeah. uh yeah but yeah i've been there and like i don't like i that. don't like that yeah i don't it's just so like even for the opposite side i have to pee I like so to, badly but i'm like are we gonna hear this well, on the podcast should, i think we should wrap it up because we're gonna run out well of i time mean anyways. i just gotta pee like but eight. it's okay i think we can wrap it up <laughs> Just I mean, no, we're finish. running out of time here. We have no more camera battery. We have no juice. You're juicing, but we have no more juice. <laughs> um, can I, talking about pee, can I wrap this up with one yes, last question? Of course. Um, would you rather drink a glass of piss mm-hmm. or a glass of half milk, half piss? Oh my God. No, no, no additions. Just w- w- which one? A glass of piss. Or a glass of half milk, half piss. Because oh, we're opposite. Probably, probably just the glass of piss. I would, I, thank you. No, I would pick guys, glass of piss. What is wrong with both guys, of you? Glass of Hold piss on. on yeah, I, once I, you will get take, piss, you, you I will piss. take a piss that's <laughs> diluted any day in over dairy? drinking a piss that's fully pissed. In what dairy? do you think? You're, you're you're better than me. Yes. A milkshake, a piss milkshake. Guys, like, that's if disgusting. anything is a little bit more diluted than drinking just piss, I'm sorry. Yeah. So first of all, but it may take made it may make it taste worse. Yeah. First of all, I milk, don't give a fuck. I rather you know. Milk I rather breath? know that half of it is no. milk than half of then I'm drinking full piss. First no. of all, I wouldn't even drink. So drink you guys a glass like golden milk. showers? Everything's good. What if it curdles? <laughs> what does that mean? Like it like gets like, like, it like chunky. Like because milk starts. Oh yeah, to, you're right. Look, I'm doing ice, mil- I'm doing milk and, and piss, piss on ice. I'm good with a straw. I'm good. You like? I'm not good. I'm yeah, like, no, I'm better than. <laughs> yeah, I'm, not good. I'm like, it's all like, right. I'm doing, but I'm better than milk and piss. Because first of all, milk breath is disgusting. But imagine like, what milk have you been through? Breath. Like, yeah. Like, I don't even like milk in gen- general. Like, if I'm just gonna choose one. Okay, we're the not other. talking oat milk or piss. We're just talking I, like I'm, I'm the real, choosing, real. I, it's chug. Anything piss just that, only. that's diluted from drinking piss, and this is somebody who's been peed on. I'm still taking diluted. You got pissed on. Yeah. All the time? <laughs> that was like... All the time? All the time? Not all the time. I've just done it. Over five times, though. No. Over five times? Like two. Four. Just like your body count. And it was like my partner. Yeah. It was cool? It was hot. Yeah. Would you... Would you, in like a, yeah, would you pee on someone? Of course. Wait, have you peed on someone? I haven't. Oh, that's... Wait, that was a lie! <laughs> Guys, that was a lie. He's like, I have $1,900. No, I, I would you never want to get pissed on. No, that's crazy. You wouldn't get pissed on? No. Nah. Where was it? I still feel like you've done it. Even when that answer was like, I've done it. I, I'm yeah, doing it. Yeah, really time. targeting me. Um, I've done it in like the shower. Oh, okay. I didn't know if it was but like, does that you know, count though? Of course it counts. I mean, it what do you mean? Counts, I'm not like next less. to the water though. Yeah. But I still feel like it counts less. If you close your eyes, you're in the shower. You know what I mean? If you're pissing on me in a bed, that's like you're getting pissed on. Yeah, that's crazy. Have you done that? Uh, no. Oh, I was going to say, no one cares about the, the bedding. That's wild. Yeah. Because that's a whole other thing. Yeah, yeah. You need to have like one of those like. But my like sheets. ex loved that, and I was like, "What is what is it about it? Is it just like belittling someone?" Yeah, it's demeaning, humiliating, degrading, that type of thing. But like, I don't, I don't mind. The pay that, pigs but would understand. Oh. I think I think that's why they want I'm you to so shit good. in their mouth. <laughs> 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 okay, relax. We're not in Dubai here. <laughs> yeah, but I said this the other day. No. We're, I was talking about with someone, and I was like, "Yeah, in Dubai," and they're no. like, "What are you talking about?" And I was like, "Dude, they love to get shit on out there, apparently." Yeah. They they want to get shit on. No no no! I've never yeah. done it. I've just like I've got the email. I've got the email. That's why I've got the email. She rolled her eyes like that was the no, longest no, 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 flight no, no, no. of I've my life. Email. Don't talk to me I've about that. I've never been flight. to Dubai. I've never been to Dubai. I've got that the email. That was a long flight. She was like, okay, wait. I've got the email. That's had all. Had so much fiber that weekend. <laughs> oh man, would you get shit on for a million dollars? No no no. Billion for what? 
billion. A billion what? I rather Dollars. get I rather get shit on than like post a nude and everybody sees it. You'd to rather be get honest. okay. <laughs> That's crazy. Would Wait, you rather, why you rather a nude than being shit on? Get human shit on me. Like, like you where? Wash it can wash but where? Where's knows. the shit going? Uh, if, it lands, if it lands on my foot, fine. But like, bro, you're not shitting on my face. Okay, no, fa- not face the face. Face is like. Face, there's no number for me. Face Peter. is no number. A billion, but no number. Peter in the back. I want to know what he's thinking. <laughs> shitting. Yo, shitting. Wait, crazy. Peter, have you ever shitting got pissed crazy. on? No. Have you ever pissed on someone? Interesting. Okay. Just so, you. I actually, I somebody's pissed the bed while I was in it, though. Does that count? That's hilarious. Yeah. Yeah. How'd you react? Twice. I woke up fucking well, pissed. Well, she woke up. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I woke yeah, up. you did. No I woke pun up intended. Pissed. Yeah. pissed. I was pissed. Pissed on. Oh, you woke up and they were still asleep? They were still asleep. Hey, wait, why were they <laughs> pissing in their sleep? Because they were drunk. They hammered probably. But like, grow up. Yeah. <laughs> first of all, okay, wait, you know what my ex would do a lot? Bed. I don't know why I'm even saying this. And you know what's the worst part? It was my bed. And you know what's the worst part? Wait. You know what's the worst part? Is like you have to wake them up and they're hammered. So like you have to clean the sheets while oh, they're you like know groggy. What, At least they're like groggy and you're like, yo, you disrupted and I got pissed. Veronica, on? I, At get least the you know where the piss is. My ex would just wake up and piss at random spots. We have trauma on this. Wait, like I remember once I was like I remember once I was like in his bed and I was like sleeping. And he, he got up and I was like, okay, like he's going to the bathroom. Like he drank too much. Sleepwalking starts to come on my side of the bed. My, my phone is like plugged in charging. I'm like, oh my God. No. He's about to piss right now. I remember being like, oh, I turn around. I like remove my phone and like he holds on the wall and like <laughs> he literally starts pissing on the nightstand. I'm like, I can't do this anymore. By the way, I would take that any day over getting pissed on in your sleep. I want you to know that that is the so worst So why did you feeling. lie and say you never got pissed on? <laughs> well, that's what I'm saying. Does it count? You were never sexually pissed on, but you, was, yeah. you've was, been urinated was, upon. Which is worse. Which is, our, I would rather be sexually pissed on than <laughs> yeah, pissed you would on hope in my that, like, Guys, do you know what it is to wake up wet? I yeah, mean, I mean, like, I think like, I like, like, <laughs> No, no, to wake, to wake up You never drenched. had a wet dream? <laughs> no, I'm saying wake up dread. Your hair's wet. You're like, what the fuck is happening? Your hair? Yeah. Wait, How many beers is this guy Wait. Doing? He pissed because you're like, cuddling. The whole Veronica's thing? like, I've never done golden shower, but like golden <laughs> I've got bed. My hair pissed on. Yeah. Wait, I you mean, were cuddling. You were cuddling at this waist. Like, wait, what you, you cuddle about? when I'm you saying, wake up in the morning. I'm, I'm saying, like, like you on the other the the When yeah. someone pisses the bed, it like it like spreads like this. That's crazy. So like, was it a single bed? Wet everywhere. You're not just wet on the legs. You're wet in in the hair. Damn, I've only I can only remember pissing myself one time. How scared were you? But like, I was like, I was young and I was wearing a onesie. I remember okay. and I, was like, I was having a dream that I was pissing in a urinal and then I woke up and I was like, oh shit, I'm, I was I'm like, like, I just started pissing myself. So then I had to, you know, that was it. I don't, but I've never like been like drunk and like pissed the bed or anything. What I will say though is if I ever did do that and I was like hammered enough that I pissed the bed and then you woke me up. I am so delirious in the middle of like sleep, like regardless, like sober sleep. I wake up, I have conversations, I don't even remember it. So like drunk and waking up and like trying to clean or whatever, it would just be like, it would be horrible. It's, I can't even imagine that. It was bad. It was, it was on it. I wouldn't, I wouldn't revisit that time in my life. Well, I'm here with the piss queens. We appreciate I them love, coming uh, yeah, on talking. I love how we didn't go over any of the questions we planned yeah, on. This but was like, the Piss Pay Pigs podcast. Holy uh, fuck. Thank you so the much, Piss Pay Pigs podcast. <laughs> but uh, just to, you know, wrap this up. Mm-hmm. Thank you so much for coming on this podcast. Well, thank you so much for having us on. You yeah. guys, uh, I thank appreciate you, you guys us. for driving all the way out here. Into yeah. Middle Brooklyn. <laughs> Bath Beach. <laughs> oh, my God. To Bath Beach, yeah. <laughs> piss Beach. Pay Pig <laughs> Beach. <laughs> Thank you for coming on the Pig Piss podcast. Oh my God. I had a lo- I had a great time. Hope you guys had a great time too. <laughs> no, but for real, thank you so much for coming yeah, on. Yeah, thank you. Um, it was a pleasure. Thank you guys so much. It was a pleasure uh, having you here. Um, I, I really gotta go because I need to be. So cold. But uh, thank <laughs> you so much. about this the whole time. Yeah. She's like, she's like, like stop I'm literally like <laughs> dying. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you so much for listening. We'll see you next week. See ya. Woo! Go, go!